Blackwater Pass. Blackwater Pass. Blackwater Pass. Our parents came. <laughs> so here we are at the boat. I don't think that's the official name, but it's a bunch of rice. And my brother will try to get it because we need bait to catch the other fish. Oh, is that bird poop? Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 gross. Oh, hell no. Got some fries, and I don't know where we're gonna go fishing, but it's pretty windy, so I don't even know if you can hear me right now. Mom, kawaii. <laughs> so we're gonna head off to dockyard now. Brother saw a turbot, so hopefully he can get it. Oh, there's three. Oh, I don't know if we can get. If we can. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See those? Wow. So my brother's gonna try and triple hook him. Yeah, dude! Oh, nice! Oh god, look at that! Turbot. Okay. Okay, let's 
try and get it. They're not splashing anymore. <laughs> Good job, Ginger. Dad, careful. The Jesus. Nice. Wow. See? You see the fins? Just swirling. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> My brother got all three. <laughs> Crazy. I'm done. Wow. So my brother, he was able to triple hook this one right outside his eye. Oh, dude, this is the one you you triple hook before. Before. Yeah. This, uh, marks on the yeah, na lag lag ulit, yeah. Oh, he jigs it. <laughs> My brother Jig got two more. turbots. <laughs> we're holding it like we're the ones who caught it. <laughs> it's actually my brother. <laughs> That's a true fisherman. That's the master fisherman. During the summertime, there's usually a lot of tourists here in Dockyard because there's typically two or three cruise ships that are docked here. Okay, so we moved to this area. It used to be for the America's Cup. It's like a sailing event. And now it's just a nice big open space. Like, it's great for fishing. Alright, Mom, it's America's Cup, yeah? Yep. That's a lot. That's a lot of fries. Okay, so here we are in a different fishing spot. I don't think I've ever been here before. Have you ever been here before? Cool. cool. Yep. Oh, 
right in the middle. Yeah, dude, that's a lot. What do you mean? <laughs> oh my god. That's definitely heavy. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's really a lot. That's ugly. Look at that. Yay. We tried to fish here, but nothing was biting, so we eventually had to move on. So this is the world's smallest drawbridge and that little part, that's a drawbridge. Okay, correction. It used to be the world's smallest drawbridge. I don't know what's the current, but... Actually, it's no longer the world's smallest drawbridge because it's no longer in operation. That right there is the drawbridge. My mom and I are gonna go to Cooper's Island really quick. It's been a while since I've been here. Cooper's Island Reserve. Cooper's Island Nature Reserve. So once we get to this part, we'll be able to like see both sides of Well Bay and Long Bay. Oh, my Taona. There's already people there. All right. So there's one side. There's the other side. Oh no, my hat. Mom's gonna do a little walking. Oh, it's a bunch of seaweed. Wow. Usually this whole beach would be just white, um, but there's been some rough weather, so now there's a lot of seaweed, just like in Turtle Bay. Oh, it's so deep. It's so rough on this side, but we go to the other side. The water is so calm. If you ever have a chance to come to Bermuda, you definitely should. It's so beautiful here. And I haven't been to Cooper's Island in around 10 years. The last time I was here was for a middle school uh, school trip and it's just as I remembered it. It's practically untouched, which makes sense because it's a nature reserve and do you see that turquoise water? Oh, it's so beautiful. Hey guys, so here we are in Turtle Bay. It's located in St. David's. It's right next to Clearwater and I'll throw in some shots of that now. Um, so we're here today to cook the turbot that my brother caught earlier in the video. So my dad already skinned it. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna grill it, but before grilling it, we're gonna just season it, put some flavor into it. So let's just put two cuts into it. Oh, chef. You know what? That's my brother. <laughs> Just learning. I am definitely not a chef, but I was trying to. That was you not. need to make it even. You're supposed to go the other way. No, it's alright. Get a close up, mom. Oh my god, I think it's sprinkling. Anyways, <laughs> get a close up. Is it close? All right. So, I'm just gonna get some salt there. Rub it into there. Inside as well. Other side. I can't. You know they couldn't see you because it's focused on the fish. We should have cooked before. 
before you came. <laughs> Brother is always uh, teasing the sister. I know, right? Salt in. Let's put some pepper. Oh my god, the wind is like blowing it away. It's some, some India. Yeah, some white pepper. Some turmeric peppers. You know what? It's not even a lot of pepper. Alright, and then let's get a little bit of soy sauce. Just a drizzle. Oh my goodness, I hope it doesn't. Okay, let's just rub that in there. I'm doing this left handed, I don't know why. Inside, 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 inside the fish. Okay, okay. It's not even that open. <laughs> Falconary. No, I didn't. Olive oil? Just a, just a drizzle. We're gonna rub that in. I don't know why I'm doing this uh, left-handed. Some lemon. Okay. The next thing we should do, we're gonna get some garlic. We're gonna rub that all over the fish. You'll see this, you'll taste this later. Yes, good now. Then the next one is going to be some cilantro. Oops. Get that all over there. Honestly, I'm just rubbing everything together. Okay. Then that's about it. And then we're just going to place it on the grill. That's like pretty hot already. I'm just gonna put one fish there. Close up one. And then the next fish. Alright, so we're just gonna let that cook for a few minutes. So while the fish is uh, grilling, grilling, um, let's just cut up some sweet potato. Some, nothing to it, just cutting some slices. Ooh, wow. Wow. I don't even think there's any space really. Let's put it all around. Alright, so let's just let that cook. So, uh, since the sweet potato and the fish are already in the grill, let's make a quick salsa. Um, so first, let's add a bit of the tomatoes, some red onions in there. I love onions, so I might put a bit extra. Here we have some red and green pepper. Put all of that. Just a little bit of garlic in there. Then some cilantro. Then the last part of this whole thing, I put a bit more. <laughs> We're gonna get some avocado. Alright, let's set this aside. Let's cut this avocado in half. Okay. So, we're just gonna use half an avocado. Can we use the avocado? Check the fish? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, wow. it's three. Look at that. Let's flip the fish over. It smells so good. Hopefully it didn't stick too much on the grill. Just flip it. Wow, look, look at that. It's practically falling off the bone. Yeah. Alright. You know what? Oh man. Look at that. So that I'll just take another couple more minutes. Wow. Should get a close-up shot of that. Wow. Oh, it smells so good. Alright, so back to the salsa. Let's cut up the avocado. 
So we're just gonna use half, maybe whole, so, but let's just see first. So we're gonna make cubes out of this. Almost forgot. We gotta add just a drizzle of olive oil. A squidge of uh, lemon. Oh, and seeds. Just a bit of pepper. Oh, it's peppers just flying away. So mix that all together. Look at the colors of that. And the sun is finally coming through. So we don't just have the fish. We actually, it's like a full-on picnic. We have pork ribs, chicken, fried rice. But the main star, the main dish, is the turbot. Wow! Look at that. It actually looks really good. Whoa. Get the close-up on this. Look, the fat, the oil is just coming out. It's like so shiny. Can you, can you see it on the camera? Yeah. Oh, look at that. All right, it's basically done. So let's just transfer them over to the plates. Oh, it's so smoky and oh, good. good. It smells really good. All right, it's a bit stuck. Oh no, it's a bit stuck. Gotta get it up, smooth that. Let's get it from under. Alright, that's one. Wow. Let's get a close up on this. Get a close up, like down there. Oh. While we pull up. Look at that. Oh. Falls right off the bone. Do you see that? Oh, and it's so juicy. It's not even dry at all. Okay, let's try it. Yeah, but it's so hot now. Mmm. The lemon just comes straight through the cilantro. It's not too salty at all. Um, just the right amount. Ooh, that's so roasted. You guys gotta try it. Some salsa. Oh, I feel like that's gonna fall. Let's try that. Mmm. The perfect bite. Oh yeah, let's Apple get my brother mommy. to try this. <laughs> yeah, he's waited okay. so long and trolling in the back. <laughs> yeah, dude. What do you think? Not bad. This must be good with the fried rice. Yeah. Got some fried rice right there. Fried rice, and let's get some more. <laughs> okay. So let's see. Mm. Tastes really good. The fish, the texture of the fish is soft and it's juicy. Okay, thank you, Jasmine. Thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Fugly. Fugly, wave. Wave. Awesome. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe, and see you in the next one. And the view.